dot com slash slash make it plain. Tamika Mallory joins us now, co chair of the Women's March. Tamika, how you feeling this morning? You are holding a press conference today. Nothing. You've heard nothing from them. To make about with us. So, so just to kind of sum up briefly, because um, people have seen the video, and I'm sure maybe you heard the story, but essentially, Tamika went to the kiosk to change her seat, got to the gate, the seat wasn't changed, she raised a concern, and you ended up having to go ahead and sit in the middle seat, and then the pilot just decided you were off the plane. That That's pretty much... <laughs> The sum total of her. Right. Right. 
great. Okay. Right, right. Well, and 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 I appreciate your honesty in saying that. Uh, and, and just like the situation that was with Jonathan mm -hmm. Gilliam, you were very honest about your reaction. That still does not justify the the white male privilege reaction that occurred. Let me ask you this: though. you took a flight home later. Was that also an American Airlines flight, or was that another airline? Uh. Right. Yeah. Yeah, you can say it. You satellite radio. Because mm. the reason I asked that, and you weren't detained in any way either, so that in and of itself to me is no justification for you to be put off a plane. And all you trolls who want to say something, Tamika didn't threaten anybody. Um, she wasn't under suspicion of being anything other than a passenger. You know, they put folks off the plane for whatever suspicions they may have about them. Um, she's she wasn't dressed like a Muslim. Let's be honest about it. We know how people react to that. None of that. She and mice were not detained and they were put on an American Airlines plane. So, I mean, that to me personalizes it and individualizes it even more when it comes to that particular pilot who took you off to me because you didn't get put off the other plane. You didn't get put off the plane that took you to Miami. So you fly on planes two or three times a day. So who's the problem? It's not you. It's obviously that pilot.
You're right. You're right. Now this is the this is the pilot. Yeah, yeah. Right, right. He so he was go ahead. Uh huh. Wow. What, what, let me just back up a minute. He, when you were having the issue with the gate agent, was he, where was, he was already on the plane. Did, did I understand you correctly? He came off the plane? Okay. 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 Tamika Mallory press conference is it's ten thirty, correct? The press conference? Ten thirty. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be there. We'll be there. Folks, so uh, we're we're gonna go um and 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 be there for that. I, I'm so sorry that this um that this happened, you're right, it happens every day to people. And I, I think your spiritual attitude about it is right. You know, this happens to people like you sometimes to illuminate what's going on um, with folks whose names we don't know and who get disrespected all the time. And in this current climate of people stepping forward, uh, I noticed some of you posted last night you're very busy but you want i think i'm paraphrasing i think you said you're very busy but you want everybody to know me too applies to you also uh 
um, it, it in this climate of even me too. I mean, we're mm -hmm. talking about male aggression, particularly white male aggression, um, because they tend to operate from a position of supreme power, and um, that was that's very much the case here. So, um, sister, we we stand with you. We appreciate. It. He didn't know who he was messing with. He had no idea. He thought you were some. And y'all know Tamika looks younger. I mean, she looks very, very young. So he had no idea. He probably, he probably literally thought he was talking to a kid. And, and uh huh. Right. Wait, wait. Well, he said that after he put you off the plane? <clears throat> Are you... Are you at liberty to disclose his name? But see, folks, that lets you know when somebody's shady, when they won't give you a name. How many people have we dealt with in customer service situations and we ask for a name and nine times out of 10 they give it because they know they have to. And if not, we're going to find out. The fact that he wouldn't give his name actually says a, a, a whole, whole lot. Um, this affects all of us. It affects us as men, too, especially as black men, because uh, part of our struggle here in America um, from slavery until now has been our right to defend our women. We had the anniversary of the Million Man March on yesterday. And I deliberately posted the clip uh, 22 years ago. I still look the same, by the way. I deliberately <laughs> posted the clip that where we made a pledge to defend our women and our families. So what are we supposed to do as men when something like this happens to a sister like Tamika or any one of you sisters who are out here? Um, and, and frankly, I would have hoped some other black men like mice would have stood up on that plane and said, no, we ain't having this today. Um, and, and, and for that matter, not just in Tamika's case, but any woman who is treated that way on a plane or anybody else who's being unfairly treated on a plane, because we know that's how they like to do. American Airlines needs to get right. They needs to, they need, they need to get right with what they're doing. And if they don't, they sure did. Have you talked to Reverend Barber? Okay, good, good, okay. Yeah, right. Wow. Um, so, folks, we need to keep that in mind when it comes to American Airlines, who we fly with and with whom we spend our money. You know, and, 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 and it's my right to say that this is First Amendment freedom of speech. Uh, can't nobody suspend me like Jamel Hill for saying that. If, if people are not treating us right, we need to stop giving them our doggone money. That's it. That's that's the bottom. That's the bottom line. And uh, we need to think about it and, and support to me. So I know that at the press conference today at 1030, you all will have some, if there are further instructions we need in terms of what we need to do as a community, 
to support you, to hold American Airlines accountable. I suspect you'll have that for us. Um, sister, you know, we... What time is Justin calling in? 35. Go ahead and call Derek. Go ahead and call Derek. Yeah. Uh, so, so tweet at American Airlines. American Air, that's what it is. All right. Tweet at American Air. If we want answers, we want the pilot's name, we want him held accountable, we want a full reporting on all of that, folks. And most of all, Tamika Mallory is owed an apology. Um, absolutely. And it is, again, it is emasculating to me. So when I got that from you, I mean, I feel helpless because I'm like, I need to be on that plane or something need to happen. You know. Um, mm -mm. Hi, is this Derek Johnson? Hi, this is Andrew from Make It Plain with Mark Thompson. How are you doing this morning? Good. I know we're calling you a few minutes late, but uh, we want to get you on for yeah. your regular yeah. uh, appearance on the show right. this morning. Okay, great. I'll put you on hold and I'll go to you shortly. Thank you. That's right. That's right. That's right. I killed him, tased him, anything. Uh, and, and frankly, that could have happened to you. I mean, it happens to, to women all the time as well. 10.30 this morning, we'll be at American Airlines, 37th and 7th. At the, you're not going to make it? Okay, okay. Um, we'll, we'll be there, folks. Tweet at American Air. Tamika, be strong, sister. We're here for you. Um, and I know a lot of people are watching this and very, very interested in what's going on. Many of you are watching because you've had this very exp experience. So we not only fight for Tamika today, we fight for you. No one should have to uh, endure that type of uh, that type of um, uh, that type of treatment. Uh, thank you, Tamika, and we'll see you a little bit later. Okay. All right. Love you. All right. All right. Bye bye, Tamika Mallory. Uh, with us, folks. Uh, eight six six ninety nine Sirius. Eight six six nine nine seven four seven.